As the Yes Network presents New York Yankees baseball. And today, it's the New York Yankees against the New York Mets in game three of a five-game set from Yankee Stadium in the Bronx, New York. Brandon Nimmo in left field will lead off. Batting second, the third baseman, J.D. Davis. Michael Conforto in right field hits third. Cleaning up the D.H. Pete Alonzo. Yeah, Jay Hab towing the slab in the boogie down here today. And you see on the season, this will be his fourth start. Had one rough one where all the walks came. I think he had six and one start. Swing and a miss. Nimmo down on strikes, one away. Ground it to LeMayu. He makes the play. And fires to first. Two away. Nice play to the glove side by LeMayu. Well, we talked about how he improves the not only the offensive side of the Yankee lineup, but this side as well. Popped up, shallow left center. Right there is Gardner. And half works a one, two, three inning as the Mets go down in order. Mets nothing, and the Yankees coming to bat. What a relief for Aaron Boone to be able to pencil in DJ LeMayu at the start of that lineup playing third. Then it's Luke Boyd at first, Aaron Hicks in center. And Robert Gazelman's on the mound for the Mets, transitioning from the bullpen to the rotation. You can see three games, two starts. He's probably good for maybe 50 to 60 pitches. And here he is as he lost one to right center. Hamilton back, makes the play. A rock for the Yankees. With all the injuries, he's continued to produce. And now when he rips to right field, Conforto turns, looks, see ya. A bullet home run. Into the short porch and right. And the Yankees lead 1-0. Boyd continues to do it. Swing and a miss. Hicks down on strikes. Served the other way. Nimmo on the run, and he makes the play, moving toward the line for the final out. They're still, you know, panicking a little bit. Alonzo down on strikes. 1-1. One, one. Fly ball right field. Talkman hardly has to move. And another 1 2 3 inning for Jay Hat as he retires the Mets in order. You did miss Luke Boyd's home run, but you're caught up now as Frazier swings and misses. One away. Ground ball to short. Rosario. The throw pulls Smith off the bag, but he makes the swipe tag on Mercer going by for the final out of the bottom of the second. Yankees go down in order. 1 2 3. Ground it and threw for base hit. Well, you knew he wasn't going to walk. So swinging on 3-2. Rosario picks up a single. Swing and a tip into the glove of Kratz. And Hamilton down on strikes. Runner goes. Kratz from his knees. Fires. Got him. Oh, what a throw from his knees. Eric Kratz gets Rosario trying to steal. That's out of the... Tony Pena songbook. Swing and a miss. Kratz down on strikes. Like, you know, one day, I'm good. That one is driven to right field. Conforto back. Makes the leap. Can't make the play. And the ball caroms into right field. LeMayu, round second. Now he's going to third. Here's the throw from Hamilton. And LeMayu is in there with a triple. And shoot this ball to right field. Grounded sharply to third. Davis had him played right at the line. And that'll do it here in the third. Here it comes. Ground ball of Voigt. One away. Just not pinpoint because of, of workload. And, you know, I don't know if you want to play five games in three days. But I think it's actually going to help these two teams getting out on the field. Swing and a miss. Hicks 
down on strikes. It looked like it actually took even less spin off of the, the true circle changeup. Better control or just uh, more movement? Talkman laces one to left field for base hit. And that one gets past Smith and goes into foul territory down the right field line. Talkman round second. He's going to third. Here's the throw from Conforto. And Talkman is in at third. So Gazelman will get himself in a error. good read. Rounded softly to third. Here comes Talkman. Here's the throw. They got him. Good play as they cut Talkman off at home. Looks like, hey, what'd you do that for? But more times than not, it works. That one is driven into right center field. Hamilton turns and looks, and he's going to have to play it off the base of the wall. Frazier rounds third. He's coming home. Here's the throw. Here's the play. He's out. Beautiful relay by the Mets to get Frazier on the double by Gardner. Let's see if the Yankees will take a look at that. Let's see if the call might have been wrong. He's got to pick it, and I think he's in there. I'm challenging that if I'm on the Yankee bench. Throw beats the runner, but he's got to pick it, and the tag's too high there. I think there's a chance he got his foot in. It's worth another look. And they do not overturn it. They say that he was, in fact, out in the bottom of the fourth inning as they try to extend their lead. Alonzo rips one through the left side of the infield, a base hit to start off the fifth against Hat. See if they can turn two. There's one, and there's two. They double them up. That one's lined into center field by Ramos. It's a base hit. Swing and a miss. He strikes out Smith, and that will do it. No runs, two hits. One man left. We're halfway through. one nothing Yanks. He was hit so hard. Look at those numbers. With, with the stuff he has, David, you can't believe he has 36 base runners in 23 innings. Higashioka won on the I.L., and he goes down on strikes. Strike three, Wade down looking. So a strong inning for Steven Matz as he retires the Yankees in order. One, two, three. We'll go to the sixth in the Bronx. And the Yankees got swept in that series four games. And that's been a problem with Hamilton. He doesn't use his speed. He hits a lot of fly balls and a fly ball of Hicks. Do you remember that series, Paul? I guess I was 15, so you must have been 13. Chopped over the mound. Going back, his hat makes the play. And another efficient easy inning for Jay Happ. Sprint. He's not walking in or anything else. He's ready to go. Swing and a miss. And Hughes deals. And Hicks walks. Uh, this is a great opportunity for him to drive one into left field. The ball's sinking down and in. He missed his target. And rolled over it. That one is ripped into left field and deep. Going back as Gardner reaches up and he makes the play. Brett Gardner took an extra base hit away from J.D. Davis for the first out of the seventh. This is just the third time through the order here in the seventh. No walks. Swing and a miss. Conforto down on strikes. Nowadays, there's always, you know, a number or a metric that you can look at. He made the right call. Ground ball to Mercer. And just like that, seven brilliant innings for Jay Happ as he retires the Mets in order. He and Kratz, too, as you see Brock's numbers on the year. He and Eric Kratz really worked well together. Run him out there for one more inning. So that's really the, the clash of cultures right now going on in, in baseball across front offices. Runner goes, pitches high, and a walk to Gardner. So Brock has come on and walked two. It starts it, and if you, you think you saw it, but maybe you didn't. Ground ball, they'll go to third. They get the force there over to first, not in time. That was a nice play by Davis on a tough throw 
by Brock to get the force at third. Swing and a miss. Backhanded by Ramos and going to third is Gardner. Heads up base running by Gardner. And there's the walk, so the bases are loaded for DJ LeMayu. DJ LeMayu with the bases loaded and um, with the Yankees. We know how LeMayu is with runners in scoring position. He's been a magician. And the pitch. Chopped slowly, third base. Davis Fields fires the first, and Familia gets LeMayu for the final out. Top to second. They try out Estrada right away. One down. You could debate about this is that you have a power hitting left handed bat on the bench, not, not on the bench, but on deck in Dominic Smith. So can I get this done, this and that? I think he realizes the importance. That one's driven down the left field line, and it hits the foul pole, and the game is tied at one. Bangs up against the yellow foul pole, and Ramos. Greets out Avino with a home run, and once again, the Yankee bullpen not getting it done. Well, Michael, you had talked about it. I mean, the Dominic Smith, who's coming to the plate now, was the guy that you were worried about. And he goes down looking, and that will do it. But not before. Wilson Ramos. Nestles went up against the screen on the foul pole. 12th game for Wilson. 12 hits and four walks, 16 base runners. Chopped the third, charging is Davis. And he just gets the hustling Hicks for the second out. Sky to left field, Nimmo back. Makes the play. And Wilson comes on and retires the Yankees in order. One, two, three. He's on the mound right now, but this is just the third appearance for Chapman this season. And Meredith, on the uh, the post game yesterday, you asked Boone, lined and caught by Estrada for the second out. Oh, that, that had to hurt. Wow. 98 miles an hour and Davis gets plunked. He can he can't even put weight on that right now. Chopped to third, backing up LeMayu. He goes the short way, they get the force, and that will do it. So Chapman puts a zero up in the top of the ninth. Can the Yankees score? Last licks coming up. We shall see as former Yankee Dellen Batances will come on to pitch the bottom of the ninth inning. This will be his 13th game. And You're leading off to the bottom of the ninth. And he walked him. He's kind of increasing his lead a little bit. Right down the middle, and Gardner is down looking. You can get into a pitcher's head, get him stepping off, wor not worried about throwing strikes. There he goes, and that one served down the right field line. It's a base hit. Frazier is rounding third, and Nevin's going to hold him right there as Mercer Picks up a single, and the Yankees have runners on first and third with one man out. So the winning run is 90 feet away. And the ball goes over the head of Ramos. Here comes Frazier, and the Yankees win 2-1 to one on a wild pitch. As Kratz squared to bunt, Batances then threw the ball past his catcher, and Frazier scores the winning run, and the Yankees break their seven-game losing streak with a two to one victory over the Mets. Who knows, is this the one to get them going? Come on, come on, come on. David, can you talk about the fact that he might have seen him out of the corner when he squared the bunt? That's the safety squeeze. Come on, come on, come on. You could tell by the runner in third was not going the minute uh, Batanzas uh, released the ball, but with one out, that's a safety squeeze play. You could tell what Aaron Boone was thinking. He, was put, he put on the play.